So this is an update on my friend who's in the intensive care unit at a local hospital. Uh, they did a bronchoscopy on him. His uh, oxygen levels were just dropping and dropping and dropping. Um, and, uh, you know, without oxygen, we can't survive. So uh, the bronchoscopy found that he has I'm sorry to share this uh, upsetting news, but blood in his lungs. And so now they're trying to drain the blood from his lungs, right? And, uh, but he, so he will remain intubated and uh, going back to the coronavirus and conspiracy theories, uh, You know, one of the leading highly respected theorists says that the coronavirus per se doesn't even exist. Well, um, sorry to burst that bubble. Uh, my friend may die of it. Uh, and had we not, had, had I followed the advice of the conspiracy theorists and, uh, you know, urged... The, his wife to refuse access to uh, to refuse intubation that would have been the wrong decision because uh, <clears throat> the intubation allowed the bronchoscopy which allowed the discovery of the blood in the lungs which they're now draining so I mean this is really uh, I think very clear cut that um The best conspiracy theorist in the world uh, is uh, unfortunately uh, wrong. Coron there is a real disease of coronavirus that really does kill people and uh, pretending that it's not real is, uh, can cause deaths.